everyone this is Tara from the sticker garden welcome to my channel in part three of my October through January haul this is the final part after this video I will be all caught up showing you the beautiful stickers I have purchased over the past several months this shop is bloom paper studio and this is my black Friday order I did receive this on Jackson Pepper freebie. It is on premium matte paper in gold foil. Also this Crafts by Towie freebie. It's super functional, absolutely love this little margarita glass with the pillows, the car, the luggage, just really great functional icons. This freebie is from Nikki Plus 3, which I'm super excited to receive. I actually purchased um, the collection that matches um, this colorway in floral clip art. This is Bloom Paper Studios Black Friday freebie. This is absolutely gorgeous. This is super pretty. I love that lace circle. You also get um, a small lace square and kind of like a fancy square with some dividers. I received another Bloom Paper Studio Black Friday freebie, um, a lace circle with some uh, simple square boxes. Getting into my order, I did purchase the Dainty Floral Dividers 2.0. I ordered, I'm not sure how I ordered the foils. Oh, okay, this is what I did. So this is her light gold. She does offer traditional gold and light gold. And this is on glossy paper. Rose gold. And then I purchased two um, of the Dainty Floral Dividers in silver just because all my winter spreads are in silver foil. So I wanted to make sure I had enough of these um, to last me all winter. I purchased some more snowflake. Um, and these are the snowflake dividers 4.0. I've been using these in my spreads and I absolutely love them. Um, I'm filming this on a Thursday and actually tomorrow she is the uh, part of the PVC sale. I'm actually thinking about going back and ordering more of these. These um, dividers just look so beautiful in spreads. Um, and I think before when I purchased them, I only purchased one sheet, so now I have two, which is great, but I have a feeling I'm gonna go through these super quick. I also purchased the Long Hanging Snowflakes in silver. Again, this is all on glossy paper. the small hanging snowflakes in silver. So I already purchased the Christmas banner 2.0, but again, I realized very quickly after I made a lot of my purchases that all my winter kits are in silver. So I wanted to make sure um, I had doubles of the stickers that I really um, like and that I felt like I'd be using a lot through winter. Um, so I purchased another sheet of the Christmas banner 2.0 in silver. And then Christmas Banner 3 in silver. I also purchased the Floral Labels 11.0 in light gold, silver, and rose gold. Oh, and then a double of the silver. I don't know, let me pull out my planner here. These look like they would. So this is the Sadie Stickers um, 7x9 planner. Yeah, so it looks like it takes up like a, pretty much like the full width of the column. They're really pretty. I keep really, I'm really excited to incorporate these into my spreads. All right. I also purchased the Lace Label, um, looks like 21.0. And that's in light gold, silver, rose gold. And these look like they definitely will take up 
the full width. Let's see. Oh yeah, they definitely do. That's really pretty. I always struggle getting stickers back on the sheet, <laughs> sheet correctly. Okay, and then these are absolutely gorgeous. These are the Lace Labels 24.0. And I got these in light gold, silver, and rose gold. I'm gonna bring them up just a little bit closer because the detailing is beautiful. Stunning, these are so pretty. Then I purchased the Dainty Divider 17.0. Um, these are on glossy paper and I got them in light gold, silver, and rose gold. So that is my order from Bloom Paper Studio. Like I mentioned, I'm filming this um, Thursday night and I know tomorrow, Friday, she is a part of the PBC, PBC sale. I think she's offering 20% off. So if you see anything you like, uh, definitely head on over to her shop. She keeps all her stickers and all her two, $2 Tuesdays in her shop. Um, the $2 Tuesday stickers, which I believe these were, um, they are at the regular price now, but um, she's having a sale tomorrow. So, um, all right, so that is my order from Bloom Paper Studio. This shop is Crafts by Towie. This is my Black Friday order. This package was absolutely beautiful when it arrived and I tore it open and I destroyed it and <laughs> I kept the tissue paper just to show you but it was definitely a lot more well packaged than this but um I did order quite a few things so let's take this all out here so I did receive some freebies um I'm not sure for Black Friday, I'm not sure if it, like if you ordered within a certain amount of time, you got um, shop samplers or if she just randomly threw them in. Um, I do know that I did receive this gorgeous um, Crafts by Towie pen with my order. I think you received it if you spent over a certain dollar amount. And so that's really cute, really pretty. Um, so we'll open this up first. So this is a freebie from Peach Palm. They are semi-transparent mini adhesive notes. I also received a freebie from Bloom Paper Studio. This is um, on uh, in rose gold. I just received um, another order from Blue Paper Studio and I received the same freebie, but in silver. So it's pretty cool. I received this in rose gold. So now I have two of those. Another rose go gold sampler from Miss and Meal. This is from The Giving Girl. And a shop sampler from Two Little Bees. Super excited to receive this. Um, I've actually received another one of these in another one of my Black Friday orders, but I have this collection that I'm gonna be using soon. So always nice to be getting um, freebies that correspond to collections that you have. Oh, and okay, so this was her uh, 25 plus Black Friday freebie. You have the shopping bags, the wine glass, um, it looks like a latte cup, um, the baking icon, a, a tree, some boxes, the fork and spoon, wrapping paper, a computer icon, and some books. And that is on rose gold, uh, excuse me, gold foiling. And then this is super pretty. Um, you have some um, cutout shapes here, and then this is an ornament that's really pretty. And then these are like really, really dainty dividers. Those are so little. Yeah. Super pretty. I absolutely love this ornament cutout. This is the 100 plus freebie. 
Um, absolutely stunning. I love the hanging snowflakes. The snowflake garland right here is absolutely beautiful. I love that. I hope she eventually brings that to her shop because it's really, really pretty. And then you have some scallop petters here. And I think these, yeah, these look like they're not kiss cut. They're just squared out. Oh, look, they're on transparent matte paper. That's awesome. I love that. Yeah, that's so cool. Super pretty. Okay, so like I said, I have a lot. I really stocked up. She doesn't really have a lot of sales, so I always splurge on Black Friday um, to stock up on icons and and such. All right, so I purchased the bath time in gold, rose gold, and silver. The nail polishes in gold, rose gold, and silver. The pens, um, I don't have these in my collection. Um, and I love using them. So I have a couple of these um, that were on freebies and I love using them to mark to-do lists or something um, that like I needed to get done at work, anything like that. But I absolutely love the shape of them and I love incorporating them into my spreads. So I purchased these in gold, rose gold and silver. So super random, but <laughs> I did get the baseball icons um, during the summer. My youngest and I, we absolutely love playing t-ball. Um, he's two years old, so I realized over the summer I had no baseball or like ball icons. So I purchased these in gold, rose gold, and silver. And then the football icons in gold, rose gold, and silver. The Patriots, so I'm from New England, so I'm a Patriots fan, and they just like horribly lost their playoff game, but like it was bad. But anyway, <laughs> I'll have an icon to mark that now. <laughs> and the prescription bottles in gold, rose gold, and silver. The bicycle icons for the summer. Super excited. We're going to be teaching our toddler uh, to ride a bike this summer. So I purchased those in gold, rose gold, and silver. The blood sample icons. Oh, I'm really excited about these. So I'm a nurse, and when I work, um, I will often... Uh, come across like new medications or new procedures and I like to mark them in my planner I go home and I research them and I learn about them and I realized that I didn't really have a lot of medical icons to mark that in my planner um, so I picked these up and I think these these are gonna these are really cute so I got those in gold rose gold and silver sick day in gold, rose gold, and silver. The pet sheet in gold, rose gold, and silver. So many cute icons. I love the leash. I love the dog toys, the bone, the food icon with like the uh, dog food on the on the ground. It's really cute too. The stethoscope, again, just to mark like uh, work things and doctor's appointments. I got the praying icons in gold, rose gold, and silver. The court in session icons. So <laughs> I don't go to court, thankfully. <laughs> um, but I do have a fourteen, a fifteen-year-old who um, definitely wants his independence, and uh, he's often grounded. So <laughs> I thought these would actually be really funny to mark um, when he's grounded, or if I have a hard day with him in my planner. Um, I thought that would just be a funny way to mark that. So. Um, these are, I purchased these in gold, rose gold, and silver. I think these were 
new um, the laptop um, icons oh yeah yep the laptop 2.0 um, so she redesigned them um, and it has like a little coffee cup next to the laptop the SUV which I also believe was a new release for Black Friday and then the salad icon I love salads I eat them all the time I'm absolutely obsessed with trying new salads making new salads um, anyway that's not interesting <laughs> um, so I just purchased these in gold rose gold and silver so for the Black Friday she also came out with these really pretty calendar icons they're not foiled um, so I just got them in this pink colorway and then in a neutral colorway. I purchased the winter, the 2021 winter icons in gold. Oh, did I do doubles? I did. I always love it when I surprise myself and get doubles. <laughs> um, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, so let's just pull these three sheets out. So um, on the sheet, um, it's a whole bunch of different icons. You get some like baking icons, the Christmas tree, a sweater, the fireplace. The fireplace is really detailed. It's really pretty. Um, the presents, the wreath. You have a little um, string light icon, some um, Christmas ornaments, the calendar with the 25th, presents, two stockings, just a really good sampler sheet for the holidays. All right. I also purchased, so I absolutely love um, Brit's freebie from Plants with Brit. She has um, these lace boxes, and I think she also has like these little mini lace circles on her freebie. So I wanted to purchase like the large sheet of these. Um, during her Black Friday, during the Black Friday sales, so I purchased them in gold, rose gold, and silver. And this is a pretty large sheet. Like this is like the size of like a kit sheet. Um, and then I purchased the large doily circles. These are so pretty. I love these. Okay, I'm bring you up so you can see like the detailing so pretty and I wonder if they I'm being so brave peeling stickers off sheets tonight yeah it takes up pretty much like the full width of like a column okay that's pretty good actually okay all right <laughs> so I purchased those in gold rose gold and silver So I also picked up the scallop boxes. I don't have any of these in my collection, so I definitely wanted to purchase some. It looks like you got some quarter boxes, some third boxes, and then a row of half boxes, and then some scallops on the bottom. And then I got the mini scallop collection. Oh, so these are just, no, so these are just the quarter and third boxes. In gold rose gold and silver I actually really like these two sizes I don't usually use like half boxes anymore like very rarely do I use half boxes it's more quarter and third boxes that I use all right so that is my order from crafts by Tally this shop is Sadie Sickers. I did put Lauren's name in the notes of seller. Um, she is Plan Much Plans on Instagram. Absolutely love her freebie. I know I mentioned this in a previous haul, but <laughs> I call these little like dot cluster alien footprints. <laughs> I don't know why. Like when I first saw her freebie, that was like the first thing that popped in my head. I was like, oh, those look like little alien footprints. So the name kind of stuck. Um, the scallop circle is absolutely beautiful and then you have the bow dividers with some garland here and her freebie is in rose gold on um, rose gold on premium matte paper 
So I purchased this absolutely stunning uh, collection entitled Wildflower. The second I saw it, I fell in love with it. I cannot wait to use this um, in uh, my planner um, this coming spring. Um, this is in um, her new format. So you have your nine full boxes here. The quote box says, you belong among the wild wildflowers. It's really beautiful. I love the box with the two girls with their birds in the background. Her fuzzy foiling is absolute perfection. This is really cute with the letter with the little um, quill. Is that what it's called? Like the writing quills? I think that's what it's called. Um, and the letter there, the greens and the um, cream color is just so beautiful with the blues. And then on the bottom you have some boxes. You have some scallops up top here, some half boxes, and then as you go down the page, you have some quarter boxes and some third boxes. What I really appreciate about Sadie stickers um, in this page in particular is these boxes, they're not just all like a perfect square. So as you can see, like this one's scalloped, this guy over here is notched, and it's just very creative. and. Um, just opens up a lot of crea uh, creativity. Creativity. I cannot talk tonight. It's like 10 o'clock right now. So <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> I'm struggling. But anyway, um, it just opens up the door to being very creative in your spreads. Like this box right here that's notched as well. And then I love the midi boxes on the bottom here. And the boxes are very lightly foiled, which I appreciate as well. Your third page, you have your confetti headers, you have your floral, uh, floral patterned headers, and then your lined headers. You have your Monday through Sunday box. And then you have your bow checklist, checklist box right here, your Monday through Sunday trackers. You get two of them. And you have some flags and some layering items. And then your bow flags right here. Here is your bottom washi. The bottom washi, um, you have like the double line, um, double line fo uh, foiled with the floral pattern on the bottom. So pretty. Look at that. That's stunning. That's so pretty. Alicia does the fuzzy foiling perfection. Like she has perfect, um, perfected it. Um, you have your Monday through Sunday date covers here with some extra boxes. Um, and then you have some scallops right here. So this is actually like a single scallop header. And then you have these little lined headers here. I also picked up the wildflower journaling page. I have come to absolutely love this page so much to work with so much to do I absolutely love how she always has the two circles um, and it kind of varies from collection to collection how the florals are arranged on the circles but they're so much fun to incorporate into your spread and then of course I've said this before also these torn pages elements um, like this it's supposed to look like torn pages they're so much fun to pull into your spread and you do get some deco pieces and then some watercolor swatches and just various shapes that you can use as well. It's not foiled, so I don't know why I'm like moving it like it's foiled. <laughs> um, and then I also purchased three of the Wildflower floral add-ons. I've been, well before, I usually have picked up four, but lately I've realized I've only been really using three floral sheets. And I'm not gonna lie, <laughs> only purchasing three has given me a little bit of anxiety because I'm like, well, what if I need more? But um, I've been pretty consistent in just needing three floral deco sheets. So <laughs> I still get anxiety though. I'm like, I feel like I need four. Um, so yeah, so that is the Wildflower Collection. Absolutely stunning, and I'm so excited um, to pull this 
um, to use this in my planner this coming spring. I feel like it's almost like an end of spring, almost into summer collection. I don't know. All right, so that is Wildflower. And then Alicia, the shop owner, was absolutely so sweet and sent me the Blossom collection. Absolutely made my day. I was so excited to receive this. So again, this is in her new format and it, it is in gold foiling. The colors just scream spring to me. And when I first saw this too, um, you have like the pinks and then like the teals. For some reason, I thought this would just be a really good Easter collection. If you wanted a collection for the week of Easter that didn't scream Easter, but like reminded you of Easter, I don't know. I don't know what it is about the color scheme that makes me think Easter, but I think Easter. Um, you have your nine full boxes, you have your fashion flat lay with the sunglasses and the floral um, elements that are foiled. The quilt boxes blossom and look how pretty this box is. That was such a good idea to foil it this way. So you have like the yellow bouquet with the foiled bouquet over it. So pretty. Love that. You have the shop storefront with a foiled bicycle up front. And then your floral boxes. So pretty. And then you have like the little garden center with the boots and the watering can. And then I'll go over this, this just a little bit more quickly since the format's the same. You have your scallops and your boxes. Again, I absolutely love how um, it's very minimal um, foiling. That way you can add foil as you would like. You have your confetti uh, foiled headers, your floral headers, your line headers. These two boxes are so beautiful. Like the color, the colorway in this collection is just stunning. It's beautiful. It's perfect for spring. And then the bottom washi here, you have your simple line divider with the floral thicker washi. I don't think I um, pulled them up, um, pulled it up in the other collection, but this has changed in her on um, reformat. But this is like the top washi is thinner than the bottom washi before they were the same size. Monday through Sunday date cover, some more boxes. And then again, you have the um, simple line, um, small headers with the scallops. Fuzzy foiling is perfect. And she also sent me the journaling page. So excited. I am so, so thankful. Thank you so much, Alicia. It seriously means the world to me. Um, and can we just take a moment and look how beautiful that box is with the florals coming out behind it? Absolutely beautiful. And that is Kiss Cut. There you go. So pretty. I'm so excited to pull that into my spread. Um, and then you have like the layering shapes, the watercolor swatches, and some deco pieces here. Love that floral bouquet. And then she sent me um, two floral sheets um, that matches the collection. I absolutely love this floral bouquet. I really like how she has also been incorporating single floral elements into all her, um, all like the floral add-ons. Um, I really like pulling in the single elements, not only for the day cover deco, um, but to layer underneath an icon as well. These bouquets are absolutely gorgeous. This whole collection is gorgeous. The colors are just amazing. So that is my order from Sadie Sickers. Alicia, if you're watching, thank you so much for sending this to me. You are absolutely so sweet, so thoughtful. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. And that is my order from Sadie Sickers. This shop is Sticker Guru. Um, I believe this order was also placed during Black Friday, which it seems like most of this stuff was. 
Um, so I did receive this beautiful journaling card um, with my name hand lettered on the back. I put Lisa's name in the notes to seller from um, Moon Prism Planner. Lisa and I go way back to when I first started planning. We were actually on the first PR um, team I ever was on was um, Cozy Stickers Co. She's not open anymore, but Lisa and I um, were on the PR team together and we've kept in touch. Um, so I always put her name in the notes to sell her to support her. Um, her freebie is so cute. She has the weights, the two drinks, some floral elements, and then some scallop uh, mandalas. And that is on glossy paper. So, oh, it looks like I have another journaling card. That's really pretty. So I just purchased the February monthly collection. This is the first monthly collection I've purchased from Sticker Guru for, I'm pretty sure it was Black Friday. She came out with the entire year of monthly collections with matching weekly collections. So it was a pretty big release. Um, so this is the first page here. You have your, um, like the top of the month stickers, and then this is this. Okay, so these are layering shapes. I'm not even in frame, sorry. So you have circles. What are these? Oh, like they're like corner scallops. And then little flags. Those are. And I believe, oh no, so. Um, you have layering shapes there, and then this looks like little thin strips of washi. Yeah, so those are little thin strips of washi. Perfect for marking um, like events in your monthly spreads that happen over a period of time. I really like the contrast of the green with the pink too. That's really pretty. Um, so, no, so, okay, sorry, I'm just not familiar with their format their monthly kit format so this strip in this strip is like the monthly headers where like you put the days and then this is actually the decorative sidebar and they're um, like their overlay foiling is really pretty there it's like confetti with like little star clusters let's see if I can like pick it up there we go um, so it looks like on this second sheet here, you get the February holidays. These looks just like little boxes. Yeah, little thin strip boxes. Um, some labels, some bill dues. And this is foiled in rose gold foiling. The third page here, you get some um, day boxes, some more labels. These, sc these scallops are really pretty. I really like that floral the floral pattern on the scallops and then these look like they're like um just floral full day boxes oh you know what i bet it is is to cover up like the days from the previous month and the next month so really pretty so that is the base kit for the monthly collection and then I did purchase the February monthly deco. Oh, look, I went all out here. So I, I purchased four. Um, you have some of the matching bouquets, um, some single floral elements, and then some birds that go with the collection as well. The February monthly add-on, I can't remember. I should have kept my invoice. I can't remember if this was an add-on or if it actually came with the collection, but because it says add-on, I'm going to assume it was. <laughs> um, so you have your date dots and then just some layering shapes here. And then this did come with the collection. This, uh, These are your Monday through Sunday um, day covers. You have some happy birthday scripts, day off, payday, and then you have some really cute icons down here at the bottom. And this is on glossy paper. All right, and that is my order from the Sticker Guru. Oh no, there we go. This next shop is Saucy Stickers Co. This is my Black Friday order. Her packaging is always so cute. 
So I did receive this Black Friday freebie. It is on premium matte paper in um, gold foil. You have um, a box here, some circles. This is really pretty, that uh, design. And these are just some lace dividers and this really pretty floral. So she re-released this spring day collection and then released another collection that I purchased. Um, she came out with spring day last season and I passed on it only because I already had all my spring collections. I was so happy when she announced she was going to bring it back in her new format. I absolutely love the blues. Um, it's almost like kind of reminds you of winter because you have like the blue watercolor with the silver foiling, but it's definitely spring with the birds, the florals, um, the shoes. Um, so we'll, let's take a closer look. So you have nine full boxes. The quote box says the morning will come again. No darkness, no season is eternal. Sorry guys. Again, it's like 10 o'clock at night. <laughs> way past my bedtime I'm like too old to be up to 10 o'clock <laughs> um absolutely love this box with the birds on the um the clothesline or the wire there this is absolutely gorgeous um the book with the florals I love the background here the wood grain background the sunglasses the shoes with the top foiled so pretty then you have the box here with the camera and the Polaroids on the clothesline. Absolutely stunning. I love the colorway. Um, you do have some um, labels here on the bottom. The second page here, you have your confetti, um, your confetti foiled headers, your pattern headers, and then your line headers, your Monday through Sunday day covers. Lots of layering items here, your bow checklist, and then you got some unique shapes here to layer with as well. The third sheet here, these look like headers, yep, pattern headers. You got six of those, some midi boxes, um, some third boxes, half boxes. Again, I really appreciate when shops don't overfoil their boxes. Um, it's just leaves room uh, for you to be creative and foil them in your own way. This is the bottom washi. I just want to kind of put it together here. Like, look how beautiful that is. That's so pretty. I wish I could get like the whole thing in camera, but I'm so excited. I absolutely love the watercolor blue with this um, lilac purple color. All right, so your washi page, you have your um, line uh, your line, um, blah, 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 your line washi strip here, and the top line is thicker, and then like the second line is thinner, and then the wood grain floral for the bottom half of the washi, your Monday through Sunday trackers, your Monday through Sunday box, your bow checklist with some additional boxes on the bottom, and you get some flags with additional layering item. Um, icons there. So this is part of her reformat. Last year there was not a floral sheet to go along with this collection. I'm so happy she designed it. Um, this sheet is so pretty. How many did I pick up? Looks like I picked up three. <laughs> See, I'm surprised I picked up three in these because when shops have deco on a full sheet like this, I usually pick up two, but I went a little crazy during Black Friday, like actually a lot crazy, but um, anyway. All right, so she has a lot of indi individual floral pieces here. This deco piece is so pretty. I absolutely love the curvature of that. Um, you do have some floral bouquets. This one's really pretty too, how it's like flat, like it's cut like straight. So really pretty. I can't wait to incorporate this um, with the collection. There's going to be so many great layering opportunities um, with this sheet. And then, of course, I picked up the journaling um, page. You get kind of like that um, torn paper sticker. 
This is really cute. This is actually like a Polaroid. That's so cute. I'm already thinking of all the things that I can do with that. Love that. Um, you get like the torn um, pages, stickers to do today, um, a little stamp, some um, deco pieces with some florals, and then this um, watercolor swatch says, the morning will come again, no darkness, no season is eternal. So it's the same as the quilt box. Super fun, I can't wait to see how I incorporate these into the collection. So that is spring day. And then I also purchased a blossom. So pretty. I absolutely love everything about this collection. Everything. <laughs> the colors, the full boxes, everything. Um, so you have your nine full boxes. And then um, the double box scene is some houses with a little foiled bicycle. I am a huge sucker for double box scenes with houses in it. I don't know why. It's like the weirdest thing. I absolutely love it. Um, the quote box down here says grow. You have the window with some like um, garland here that's foiled. A bicycle with some foiled butterflies. And then this is really, really pretty. She has like the floral bouquet and then she has like the foiled flower outline. Am I picking that up? Here we go. So pretty. Um, the second quote box is happiness blooms from within. You have a cute little caffeine cafe um, scene with the two chairs and the table. And then another floral bouquet box with that outline. So pretty. I love these colors. Um, again, same format. So I'll just go over kind of quickly. I absolutely love that she pulled in um, that blue color for the headers along with the peach. And then, of course, you get your floral um, headers. You got your, the third page is all your boxes. Again, very lightly foiled, which I really appreciate. And then you have six pattern headers up here. The bottom washi is so pretty. I absolutely love the foil garland. Um, and then the florals that seem to come up, like grow up from the bottom washi. So pretty. And then foiled throughout um, is just some uh, leaves coming out of the florals. Of course, I have to do this. I always, so pretty. I'm so excited to use this collection. It's so, so pretty. Um, habit trackers, your Monday through Sunday box, some extra layering elements. Um, I also purchased three of the Blossom Deco pages. Um, again, she offers so many um, arrangements. You have your single elements. These are really interesting. Um, this is just like an outline of the floral and you get them in different colors. So you get them in the pink, blue, and green. Um, and then you have some single watercolor elements. Absolutely, I'm a sucker for the floral drops. I don't even know if that's really the name. I just make up names as I go along here, but I'm calling this a floral drop. <laughs> Love those. Um, again, you have like the corner bouquets. Super pretty. Great sheet. So excited about this collection. And that is my order from Saucy Stickers Co. This shop is the Pretty Pink Co. Again, I have destroyed the packaging, but I did want to show you because her packaging is very beautiful. You always get this really pretty Happy Mail sticker. And then your name is always hand lettered on the back on this little gift tag. So cute. So this is my Black Friday order. And I did already use one of the, the collections. I actually got three collections and some icons. Um, and I'll show you, I will take out my planner and I'll show you that collection um, laid down. Um, but all right, let's start from, the, start from the top. So I did receive this really pretty journaling card. And then this was a freebie. This is on matte paper, uh, transparent matte paper and gold foil. So excited to get these hearts. I actually did purchase, um, she came out with these for a $2 Tuesday and I purchased um, a couple sheets of those. 
is that a full box? Yeah, so this is like a like a full box overlay or underlay, however you would want to use that. I also received um, another freebie in hollow foil. These are so pretty. I put Alyssa's um, name in the notes of seller. Um, Alyssa is Silver Antler Planning on Instagram. Absolutely adore her freebie. She has the butterfly, the yoga, uh, the yoga girl, the computer, some floral elements, um, the dividers, um, a sparkle cluster, and some paw prints. And her freebie is in rose gold. All right, so. Oh, okay. One more freebie. I always get tons of freebies from the Pretty Pink Cow. It's so much fun. Um, so this is another freebie on, on transparent matte paper and gold foil. Um, it's a lot of holiday themed pieces. So you have the wreath, the stockings, um, snowflakes, the star clusters are really pretty. Um, candy canes. Just a very well thought out freebie. So I purchased um, the snowflake strings, I think it's 1.0, um, in gold, silver, and rose gold, and she does offer trans uh, transparent matte paper. Oh, there's like something on there, sorry. That was not a foiling mistake, that was just something on the paper itself. These are so pretty. Super excited to use those. Um, I also purchased um, the dog paw bow icons. Um, I purchased these on um, premium matte paper um, in silver, gold, and rose gold. Can never have enough paw print icons. <laughs> so I did purchase three collections, but like I said, I've already used one. Let me move over my big pile here. So I already planned out, I think it was like two weeks ago. Um, let's see. Yeah, so this is, uh, or this was the first collection. Let me see if I can like zoom you out a little bit. There we go. So I haven't posted this spread yet on Instagram, but I plan to next week. Um, I just haven't had time yet, but absolutely love this collection. Um, it was um, on silver, um, premium matte paper, silver foiled, absolutely loved everything about it. Very similar to the Crafts by Taui, um, co a winter collection that also came out for Black Friday. But what really drew me to the Pretty Pink code, uh, Co's was just the simplicity of it. Um, I really liked how simple, um, simple foiling, if that makes sense. Um, I felt that the foiling um, in the Crafts by Taui collection was just a little bit too busy for my personal taste. Um, so I went with this collection. So stay tuned. Check out my Instagram. I will be posting close-ups of that spread next week. Um, all right. So this is the second winter collection I purchased. It is called Let It Snow. All right. There's like dog hair everywhere. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> All right, moving on. Um, so this collection is called Let It Snow. It is in silver foil. I absolutely love the blues um, and the grays. And then you have the contrast um, dark pinks and um, like that cream color here with the greens. Absolutely stunning. I thought this would be a good collection um, near um, Valentine's Day. Uh, maybe like the week before or after since you know Valentine's Day is in February still cold so you have the winter theme but you have that really romantic pink and peach tones so you do get nine full boxes the quote box says let it snow this scene here with the girl in the cabin absolutely beautiful you have like the foiled snowflakes Super pretty. This box right here, the bell's super cute. There we go. 
and you have um, another winter scene with um, the bench with some pillows a lantern and then again that very simple snowflake foil foiling your floral boxes are very lightly fuzzy foiled super pretty the second page here you do have some midi boxes some quarter boxes third boxes and then some layering shapes on the bottom I really love how the pretty pink go provides kind of like a scene box I guess you would call them so it's not whited out in the middle but you do kind of, you have a scene that matches the collection super fun and you know just super interesting to find new ways to use those boxes and then down here you have um, a strip of scallop a scallop strip. In this page here you do have your um, floral headers. It is foiled and then your um, confetti headers right here. You have various shapes uh, with the floral accent on them. Your flags, your layering shapes, you have two scallops and then two habit trackers. And then look how beautiful this washi is. I just absolutely love this collection with that bright, with that pop of red and pink. Like look how pretty that's gonna look together. Oh, I'm so excited, I love it. I love collections that have contrasting colors. Like that, it really draws me in. Um, so your top strip uh, washi here is snowflake. Uh, snowflakes foiled and then you have your floral bottom uh, bottom half here your Monday through Sunday headers <clears throat> excuse me day covers some two layering shapes and then your Monday through Sunday box there with the little bell clip art that was in the full box and then I did pick up the deco Again, I picked up two, sh two, two. Um, I absolutely love the Pretty Pinko's um, floral sheets. They're so fun. And I, I know I've mentioned this before, but the clip art that she uses can match a lot of other kits as well. So even if you don't buy a collection, I highly suggest checking out her deco sheets. Um, I know I bought so many of her fall deco floral deco sheets and I've incorporated them into pretty much every single one of my spreads. Um, so you have various uh, floral bouquets here, individual shapes, um, you have some um, like half circle floral bouquets, just really pretty. And then um, I think this is was like the deco, okay so the full floral sheets um, she labels them as like the Deco 1.0 and then there's 2.02 as well. You have your floral, like the half floral bouquet, bouquets you can incorporate into your spread or put on top of the date covers. Um, you do get some clip art pieces and then I absolutely love these um, shapes that are colored in with the collections colorway and then the back is um, has the floral elements. I really like this um, deco piece right here. That's really pretty. So that is the Let It Snow collection. And then I also purchased the Floral Fairy Tale collection. This is absolutely stunning. I'm running out of room here on my desk. Let me try to like clear some of this off. Okay. Um, so again, you have your nine full boxes. The quote box says, let us live like flowers, wild and beautiful and drenched in sun. Absolutely beautiful. I love the girl here with the butterflies, the florals. I love that wildflower look. Um, you kind of have like a picnic scene here, the bicycle. Um, it looks like a little, yeah, so it's like a, um, a market sign. What does it say? Fresh flower market, seed stems and blooms. It's super cute that there's so much detailing in that sign there. 
absolutely love the ice cream no so this is actually so there was some clip art last year that this was actually like an ice cream cone with florals but it's actually um it looks like um why am i drawing a blank not piano paper oh my goodness okay well i can't remember it but it's like the piano it's sheet music sheet music <laughs> So it's like sheet music with the florals coming out and then these look like little heart petals that are falling from the bouquet. Super pretty. And this is in, it looks like light gold, light gold boiling. And then again, you have your boxes. And this is what I was mentioning in the other collection. You always have this half box that is completely patterned that I really enjoy pulling in and seeing all the different ways um, I can use that in my spreads. So she pulled in that really pretty yellow color for the confetti headers. You have your floral headers, the different layering shapes here, um, the flags, layering I um, icons, scallops, habit trackers. Your Monday through Sunday um, date covers, some more layering elements, Monday through Sunday um, full box here. And this bottom washi is so pretty. I really, really like how she did the butterfly outline on the top strip. Well, it would probably go like this, right? Nope, like this. Um, and then just all the, um, the wildflower floral design on the bottom washi there. And I really enjoy, I really like her fuzzy foiling too. It's like the perfect amount. All right, and so then I picked up, let's see, so the Deco 1.0 that matches the fairy, uh, the floral fairy tale collection. Every time there's a floral drop, I'm gonna show you guys because I'm obsessed with them. <laughs> Absolutely love this floral drop. You have um, various um, bouquets and individual floral pieces, which I really appreciate. I purchased two of those. And then this is the Deco Flor Floral Fairy Tale 2.0. Again, you have various variations of the floral, like, um, like the half bouquets that you can put on top of the day covers or just throughout your spread. Um, the shapes here, you have some clip art pieces, some more individual floral pieces, which is great. Um, some floral wreaths, and then this little clip art piece just says spring. Super pretty. Can't wait to use that for spring. Absolutely love the colors in both of these collections. And that is my order from the Pretty Pink Co. That is everything for this haul video. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. I greatly appreciate all your support and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye.